everybody, Brent here, and this is gonna be a little bit of a different video. This is gonna be a behind the scenes video because I recently got the opportunity to do one of the coolest gigs that I ever could have imagined, and that was to play an instrumental version of the national anthem before the home opener football game at the local university. Now, it's particularly special to me because A, I'm a huge football fan, B, uh, I went to the university. This is the university where I got my music degree, so I was a student, and now I also teach a course at that university as well. So super special to me to take part in that. Now this all came about because a little while back I did a gig that was a Woodstock themed show where we all played songs from Woodstock and of course I did a Jimi Hendrix version of our national anthem. Now if you're watching from outside of Canada, our national anthem is of course O Canada and at that show I did a Jimi Hendrix inspired version because of course at Woodstock Jimi Hendrix played his own version of the Star Spangled Banner. So usually what happens with these things is, of course, there's always videos at the end of the actual performance, but I wanted to give you a sneak peek into what goes into that actual kind of performance and things that I took away from it. So I shot some behind the scenes footage leading up to and on the day of the actual performance, as well as a little bit of footage of the actual performance itself. So uh, just a couple things I took away. I make some comments in the behind the scene videos as well as we go along. So. Let's take a look, and uh, it was it was one of the best days ever, one of the coolest gigs I'll ever do, and uh, looking forward to doing it again for sure. Hey everyone, Brent here, just on the field at the football field here at Saint Effects University, my alma mater, where I teach, and uh, on Saturday is the home opener for the football team. I'm going to be playing the anthem here, so. Uh, so I want to get some footage as we go along. I'm going to uh, record the whole process. It's Thursday today. I just uh, met with the event organizers about how we're going to set up, where I'm going to be, that kind of stuff. So just getting that stuff out of the way so that we know on Saturday we're good to go. Super excited. First time playing at the football game. I'm a football fan and uh, it's going to be cool and uh, hopefully something we can do more and more. But uh, hopefully the weather is good like today. Beautiful day, beautiful temperature, no wind. So. Uh, we're gonna uh, we're gonna take some footage for the whole thing and uh, and hopefully uh, show you some behind the scenes stuff and then I'm gonna show you how I uh, how I play the anthem on the guitar. We're gonna do kind of a rock version of it. So uh, stick around. We're gonna have a look. But uh, yeah, great day today. Looking forward to Saturday. Go X go. All right, everybody. It's Saturday morning uh, here at Saint FX Now I'm gonna go in and uh, get ready for sound check. Get everything set up and uh, see how it sounds and where we're gonna be standing and stuff like that. So getting excited. You know, starting to get real, a couple hours from uh, kickoff. So um, right now it's uh, a little overcast, no rain yet. So hopefully that holds off. Hopefully we get some good weather. And uh, so let's head on over. Alright, so I just left sound check and uh, sound pretty good. Best advice I can give you if you're a up and coming musician, guitar player, any kind of instrument really, if you're gonna play somewhere, make sure you do a sound check. Make sure that you uh, you know hear what it's gonna sound like. So even for someone like me that's played outdoors lots, you know, uh, the sound on a field outside, you know, it's different than home in the bedroom. You might have to adjust some EQs, you might have to adjust your gain or your tone. Uh, to get it to sound the way you want it to sound. So um, try to push for it, even if they're not giving you the opportunity, try to push for a sound check uh, anytime you get a chance. Um, especially, like I said, if it's somewhere you haven't played before, a new venue, and certainly outside is much, much different than inside. So 
the wind affects it, everything. So make sure, take your time, get some time, get a sound check in, really get a feel for what it's gonna be like when you perform so you're not caught off guard. We are about an hour before kickoff. A little bit of rain shouldn't hurt us. The boys are warming up here. Just a cheer for St. Fax, playing Bishops University. We are on the 50-yard line. We're gonna go up there in a little bit. All right, we're backstage here. I call it backstage, but it's the uh, just the equipment room off of the field. So you'll see over here, that's where we're gonna go out and play the anthem. It is raining a little bit, so keeping dry back here. Uh, should be okay for a minute or so. I don't mind going out in the rain. Uh, I got my wireless pack on, so no worries about shock or anything like that, but hopefully it goes well. Um, just back here warming up, getting ready, you know. Always a good idea to do that. For anybody that's gonna play a gig, always warm up if you're singing, warm up your voice. If you're gonna play guitar, play guitar. Uh, part of this is, you know, fighting the adrenaline. You know, you're gonna be going out there on the field to do this and stuff, so just gotta relax, breathe, warm up, make sure my fingers are gonna do what I want them to do, and uh, just get ready. So the clock's ticking, shouldn't be too long now, and uh, we'll be out there to do the anthem. So we'll see you on the other side. I would also now ask everyone All right, thanks for coming along on that ride. Hopefully you learned a little bit about what goes into a gig like that. Uh, got some insights into uh, some of the information that I gave you there as it went along. Uh, like I said, it was one of the greatest days of my life, one of the coolest gigs, and I'm looking forward to doing it again. If you ever get the chance uh, as a guitar player to do the National Anthem like that, I absolutely uh, encourage you to do it. It's one of the coolest things you'll ever do. And if you enjoyed that video, make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel, like this video, and click the little bell so you get notifications uh, anytime there's new videos because we're going to keep putting content here and it's great and it will help you as a musician as a guitar player and please feel free to share it with your friends that play guitar or are musicians so thanks for watching appreciate the support enjoy the rest of the videos have a great one